Hello everyone. Uh, we're uh, on a trail today. It's a little bit more urban. We're in uh, Quinto del Lago in the Lule County. And it's a, it's not a very long trail and I don't think it's going to be very steep at all. It's only 3.2 kilometers and it's not a looping trail so it's there and back. Now we've got uh, the Ria Famosa and the Natural Park of the Ria and we've also got a golf course. So it's a bit of a different uh, look to it. Lots of bird life. There's supposed to be a Roman ruins here as well. The, it's a low tide situation right now, and we can see the guys digging for I'm not sure what, but we're going to get closer to them. So let's continue on. We're only about 200 meters into the trail, and we've got our first marker. It's a little bit different, this one. It's a large pole with a blue stripe on it, letting us know we're on the right trail. So we're, we're here at the Sao Lorenzo Point 1, and this is a little information about what's going on behind me. Now, they're talking about salt marshes and the ecosystems that go on in it. As I mentioned at the beginning, we're in a low tide. Uh, apparently, this is a great area for a refuge for waterfowl. Don't know if we'll catch any today, but let's see if we can. So we're now in a, a little observation deck. It, uh, it's you know a great opportunity to see something from a little bit higher up. It's nice views of the Ria from here. This is where the path can split, and we've got one that goes straight and the other one that starts to curve and go in towards the golf course. That's the trail you want to continue on for this particular path. Well, it's not every day that you get to sit on a Roman wall, and this one was built in around 1100 AD. Behind me are five salt tanks, and these were used to preserve fish so that they would last longer. They were lined with uh, a limestone to stop the, the moisture from escaping. You can still see they're actually in pretty good shape. But we're going to end the trail here. I, I think there's, as far as the trail marking is going, the, the point four, which we're at now, showing the end of the trail. The, it was a very nice trail, easy to, to walk, not, no hills at all. So it was popular with joggers and mountain bikers. Beautiful views of the golf course and the Ria. If you guys can make it to here, I highly recommend it.